Hey family, welcome to Scorpio Intuitions. If this is your first time on my channel, please like and subscribe, hit that notification button. So family, um, we're going to dive into this energy, but first, most high, thank you for my beautiful, powerful collective. Anything that they're seeking clarity in, we ask you to reveal that, that truth to them. Anything that's hindering them, blocking them, we ask for it to be removed. Heavenly Father, we ask you right now to send your angels over to protect our collective. Anything that rises up against us shall fall down immediately. Victory is our portion. We walk in and we receive it in itself. All right, family. So... Don't get into this energy. Remember, this is a general message. Uh, family, I have to stress that uh, clarity comes from within. So this is not... Um, this is not me telling you uh, what you should do, how you should do it. Remember, we all have free will. I'm just here to help you clarify some things that, that you need to see through. And also, not just that, but I'm here to help you bring out the answers within yourself. Because you you will already have all the answers you need. I feel like you just need a little boost sometimes. You feel me? We all need some boost. I'm just, just, just call me your booster, okay? <laughs> I ain't still nothing but anyway <laughs> but messages of love light and power spirit uh when it comes to my beautiful powerful scorpio spirit what is it that we should be focusing on and what is coming our way messages of love light and power all right so the first two cards that came out, the first card was the star card. Right now, Spirit could be saying that there's an energy for you to heal, an energy for you to be in this um in this moment of just appreciating yourself, in the moment of appreciating, pampering, and uh, understanding what it is that that you need to move forward in a in a healthy way. Right now, this is also saying that uh, I feel like spirit is allowing you to feel what other people have always seen your beauty your intelligence your loving ways you are becoming um people are starting to see you for the beautiful person that you are scorpio and then i just add our second card is the death card so you know this is our energy right now spirit says we're in this in this time of renewal rebirth we are in this transformation stage Spirit says, I'm, transfor I'm transforming your beauty into a whole new light. It's like, like back then, people didn't want us. They didn't appreciate us. They didn't see the qualities that we had or they did, but they chose to ignore it. Spirit says, I needed you to have that time to heal, to get to know yourself, to know how valuable you are. Because once you know how valuable you are to you, then that increases the value that you that, that other people have to come in and value at the same. I mean, it kind of came out. Blah, blah, blah. Spirit is saying that once you knew your value, then when people come in and try to devalue you, you stood up for yourself. And this is that energy with the star car healing from, from the past uh, ideas that you wasn't worthy, that you couldn't become anything. And you realizing that you are worthy. You are everything. You, you can become anything you desire. Now, since you're walking in that power, people that come towards you now, they have to respect who you know that you are. And with that, uh, some people didn't like your transformation, Scorpio. Some people didn't like that you started becoming more powerful. They didn't like that they were unable to handle you the way they used to. Um, and now, because you have realized uh, if those people didn't respect you, now you cut them off. And, and, and it's like... As you begin to uh, release those things that were holding you back, now Spirit says, now there's this new abundance coming in. Every time something new come in, it, 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 it had to, there was some type of death that happened to a particular situation. A depth of old ways of thinking, a depth of uh, um, allowing certain things in your life, or continuing, continuing circles or cycles that... We're not benefiting you. Messages of love, light, and power. Right now, there is an energy of the unknown. With this uh, fool card, spirit, I mean, with this hangman, and I think about fool, so I feel like some of you guys are going to take a risk, but um, 
with with this with this hangman uh, some some of you are unsure on what this new beginning is going to bring some of you are unsure on um how the outcome to this new beginning will go and I have to say, we have three major arcana cards here. The star, the death, and hangman. Spirit says, Scorpio, you're beginning to walk into the unknown. As, as Spirit begins to show you who you are, as you begin to become this beacon of light, people are drawn to you. Uh, things are... are um, are, are pulling at your energy, trying to attach themselves to you. Spirit says right now, all of these things that are happening are happening for a reason. It's like you're walking through the unknown and what you do not know that is coming is a lot of victory, a lot of power, and a lot of, um, it's like a lot of authority. Yeah, Spirit is putting a lot of power and authority in your hands at this time, Scorpio. Messages of love, light, and power for my beautiful, sexy-ass Scorpios. Yeah, <laughs> a lot of finances. Spirit says right now that your finances are going through the roof. Um, Spirit says whatever it is that you heal from, it is helping you and enabling you to move forward in that abundance. Yeah, family. So, and with this Ace of Wands, uh, Spirit is saying because you are being um, illuminated, to the world because you are becoming this star that people are starting to admire. Spirit says there's going to be a lot of opportunity for the financial gain. I feel that right now people are starting to uh, look at you as some type of a beacon of light and people are going to want to start partnering up with you Scorpios really soon. Um, also, I feel that uh, Spirit is saying with this Ace of Cups that there is going to be new love coming in. Ooh, Scorpio. And because it's under the death card, Spirit says because you release things, um, uh, because I feel that there that there was love situations that you had to release that were very hard for you to let go. Some of you guys, I feel that it took so much strength to even get your mind off of a particular person or situation. Spirit says because you have released certain things, because you have released uh, uh, partnerships that were no longer um, uh, in union with you, Spirit says now you have this, this transformation is bringing about new finances, Ace of Pentacles, and new love. And Spirit says it's not just love and, 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 um, and having a partner, which you are have, you're going to have, uh, I feel like this is going to be a divine partnership that's coming in, but also this is, uh, new beginnings and loving new adventures, new loving. I feel like if Scorpios, there's so many things that you could do. There's so many things. It's like Scorpios, to be honest. No matter what we do, we be good at it. It's like we are the type of people that people really don't like. Why? Because whatever we put our mind to, we good at it. Like we could fuck around and just try something out. And somebody been doing it for years and we'll do it as good or better than somebody that's been doing it for years. And it, it builds up some type of uh, resentment. But with that being said, Spirit says... You're, you're going to start being able to do things that are going to bring you so much joy, things that you've never done before, which makes me feel like with this new love that is coming in, I feel like it's going to be very adventurous, very uh, emotionally fulfilling. Uh, and also, Spirit says, ooh, what you don't know, come is going to be all. Okay. <laughs> Spirit say, Scorpio, what you don't know coming with you, this hangman. It's like you walking in the unknown. Like it, like it's like you let go of some things, and you like spirit. All right, I'm letting it go. You know, these are things that's really hard. And as you are in this transformative stage, and you're moving into the news, like I don't know what's happening, but spirit says, what you don't know is that there is long term commitment, and seeing that long term commitment is right by the Ace of Cups, Scorpios. I feel like. Actually, I don't feel like it. I know something very, very abundant is coming. That relationship, some of you guys been wanting to get married. Some of you guys been wanting a long, steady relationship. Spirit says it's coming really fast, Scorpios. And not just that, but 
with the Knight of Swords, I feel like Scorpio, a lot of you guys, this could be moving fast. I feel that uh, a lot of you guys that there that you that once you get into this relationship, I feel like it's just gonna feel so surreal. And not just that, but I feel like you could be moving towards them, or they'll be move. I feel like a lot of y'all could be literally moving into new homes, moving into new places, and. Spirit says all of this is happening because you made, you have made a life decision that most people are not able to make. You have detached from things and situations that most people have not been able to accomplish. You have mastered yourself. You have mastered what it is that you truly desire. You are a freaking star and everybody is now going to see you. And it's not just seeing you uh, become great, but it's like, they're seeing everything around you become great. You're like the shooting star nobody wished upon. You're like the star nobody saw until it was too far away to reach. Scorpio. And I'm not just saying this because I'm a Scorpio and I love the shit out of us. And I feel like we are the best in the best that the world has ever uh, birthed us on this side, on this side of the signs. And I'm not saying this because I'm biased. Maybe a little bit, but <laughs> the truth is, Scorpio, the truth is what it is. We are stars and spirit says we are rising and everything that we ever decide, desired is right in front of us. So spirit says, shine bright like a diamond, shine bright like a diamond. <laughs> I love y'all Scorpios. Love y'all Uh, If you like this, please like and subscribe. Y'all, this is going to be the last month. I'm going to do uh, personal readings. All of the readings are going to be live from here on out and two, I believe, in September. So book your personal readings. Um, uh, All the information will be in the description below. I love you guys. Love yourself because we are, we are, we are the gods. <laughs>